recording yourself in PowerPoint. This video is not sponsored, not advertised. Let's go straight into how to do it. Two things you want to keep in mind when recording a presentation to video. One, animations. In the animation pane, if the presentation is animated, this will influence how long it will take for you to explain this particular slide and it will influence the length of the video. This is number one. Number two is actually transition duration. Currently, I have set the transition duration to after four seconds, meaning this slide should advance to the next slide after four seconds. But if I want to record myself speak, I will override this time anyway. Recording a PowerPoint presentation occurs in the recording tab by hitting record slideshow. Let me show this to you on a blank presentation. I'm going to recording, I'm hitting record slideshow and if you have PowerPoint 2019 on a, or a newer version, you should see this black screen, something like that. What can you do here on the right top side in the settings? Currently I have a backup microphone connected to my, uh, to my computer and I have a webcam. If you don't see a webcam, perhaps you have an older version of PowerPoint or you have the Mac version or simply something doesn't connect right. In the camera settings, I have my normal camera, which you see here, and the stream webcam Logitech C922. I can, of course, turn the preview off or turn the camera off completely. This would record only sound. Now, let me show you how to record this PowerPoint slide. On the left top side, you simply hit record. You're waiting three seconds and now I'm using the Samsung Go mic. PowerPoint doesn't record the sound quality very well, so keep that in mind, but everything is recording. I can even make a live drawing on the slide and this live drawing would be drawn during the presentation. Okay, that's perfectly enough. I'm hitting on the left top side stop. And on the left side, you see 18 seconds. This first slide will have 18 seconds, including the video and the drawing. I just exit this. On the animations pane, you see video number six has a play animation, which is simply this video being played. And ink number five has also a play animation, which means the ink will be animated the same way I drawn it on the screen. Go to transitions tab and you can see PowerPoint automatically adjusted the time when the slide advances to, to my recording. This recording has 18 seconds. Let's preview the slide now. Now I'm using the Samsung Go mic. PowerPoint doesn't record the sound quality very well, so keep that in mind, but everything is recording. I can even make a live drawing on the slide and this live drawing would be drawn during the presentation. Example on a more real example. Here is a presentation. This presentation has some animations on it and the second slide has also some animations on it, including on click animations. I would go to the recording tab. I would hit record slideshow and I will make this much quicker now. Let's hit record. After three seconds, we will record. The animations play because this is my animated uh, presentation. And let's say that welcome to super clothes. I will move forward. This is our company with blah, 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 blah. The first step I wanted to talk about was t-shirts. Then our next product is sweatshirts. Then our next product is socks. I should hide myself so I don't restrict my view. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, everything is recorded. It took me 24 seconds. I can now quit this recording and both slides, both PowerPoint slides have a video added on the bottom right corner. If you don't want to see the video, only, only wish to hear the sound, simply move this aside or in the recording slideshow, deselect your camera. That's no problem. Okay, everything is recorded. If I go to transitions, you can see here 15.8 seconds, here 8 seconds, file, export, create a video, create video. I can export this to my desktop, design anime pre animated presentation, save. It is exporting an MP4 file. Now the drawbacks of PowerPoint is that the sound quality is a bit low. The frame rate of the video is also low. Now, there is a special script which allows us to export 60 FPS videos in PowerPoint, but that's not for this video. This is now a ready video, which I could potentially upload to you. Animated a presentation. And let's say that welcome to super close. I will move forward. This is our company. Technically, this is how you can export yourself and videos from PowerPoint.